Lifeline has received a rework for Season 9, and there's been a lot of controversy on whether or not she's a good legend to pick. We're going to be breaking down the rework and talk about why she's still a great legend to play. So here's a full pro guide on how to play Lifeline. Small up yourself. AJ Shed's coming true. Better known as Lifeline, AJ has devoted her life to helping those in need. This combat medic is the ultimate support element to any squad. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Yopi, and we're going to be bringing you another pro Apex guide. We're going to be going over a fan favorite, Legend Lifeline. Lifeline's rework has gotten rid of her res shield, improved her health drone, and care package. If you find this guide helpful, please consider subscribing to the channel and leaving a like. And make sure you check out this Twitch stream down below to watch the games live. All right, first, let's break down her kit. Her passive allows you to throw down the dog drone on down teammates to res them. Her tactical is her health drone, but it heals at a much faster rate. Her alt is a care package and it grants better armor slash attachment slash seals based on what you slash your teammates have. For example, if you have blue armor, but your teammates has a gray, it will drop another blue armor. If everyone has blue, it will drop purple. It will not drop red armor. If your teammates have a gray light mag, a blue light mag will drop, and of course shield cells plus syringes. Lifeline also has one of the smallest hitboxes in the game. Paired with good movement, Lifeline becomes hard to hit, allowing you to deal consistent and constant damage without the fear of getting beamed. A common misconception with Lifeline is that Lifeline should stay back, perhaps even hide, and then res your teammates. Why would you play a fight based on the fact that your teammates will go down? This is dumb. You should be playing normally and with your team. If someone does get knocked, try to res, but only if you can. Most people try to force the lifeline res and get destroyed for it by sprinting over to the down. Play it smart as the drone res is a bonus, but it's not an end-all be-all res. You can also use the res as bait. So for example, if you're resing your teammates, the enemy might try to run over and thirst the down and then you can get an easy shot on them because they're going to be worried about getting the down. The tactical health drone. There are many uses for this, but first up is the basic one. When running out of the zone or after a fight, toss down the drone and heal up quickly for you and your teammates. Mid-fight, throw down the health drone while popping a cell or two for a quick regain. Getting better positioning is more important than healing fully in a fight, so use whatever health you get from it as an added bonus. I've seen many people sit behind a rock and heal max HP while me and my teammates are 2 v 3 Please help us, Lord Almighty! The health drone is also indestructible, allowing you to strafe slash play around it for some cheeky shots. You can heal in the storm, but the drone will break fast unless you're in a heat shield. If you're desperate, you might as well throw it down and get a couple ticks of health back up. The care package. It's pretty simple to use and we already explained what it does, but here's some more cheeky tips. You can throw down the care package as cover since it's also indestructible. You can't throw it down if there is a roof or cover blocking you. Be careful where you throw it as it could give away your positioning. Ranking Lifeline in the meta. Lifeline is definitely a top 4 pick and a great pick for ranked also. Her small hitbox gives her an advantage in fights allowing you to be aggressive. The quick revive puts pressure on the enemy team and frees you up to stay in the fight. The health drone allows you to reset and heal up quick in fights. The care package gives you better loot so you have an advantage over your enemies. Overall, Lifeline is a great legend to play and she is pretty fun too. I hope you found this guide helpful and make sure you check out the other ones on this channel. Please leave a like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. And make sure you check out the Twitch and peace out.